Imagine a hulking steel beast cruising down the highway, its sharp edges a stark contrast to the sleek curves of modern cars. This isn't a scene from a dystopian film, it's the Tesla Cybertruck, a revolutionary electric vehicle with a design that breaks all the rules. But with its radical departure from traditional car shapes, the Cybertruck raises a crucial question. Could its unconventional form pose a hidden threat on the road? Buckle up as we explore the potential risks associated with the Cybertruck's bold design. Will it usher in a new era of electric transportation? Or could its sharp angles and ultra-hard body create a safety nightmare for drivers, pedestrians, and cyclists alike? Keep watching as we peel back the layers of the Cybertruck's design and investigate the potential dangers lurking beneath its futuristic exterior. Safety Concerns the Cybertruck's exoskeleton is made of ultra-hard 30X cold-rolled stainless steel, which Tesla claims is nearly impenetrable. While this might sound reassuring, it presents unique challenges in crash safety. Traditional vehicles are designed with crumple zones that absorb impact energy in a collision, protecting occupants by deforming in controlled ways. The Cybertruck's rigid structure may not provide the same level of impact absorption potentially increasing the force transferred to occupants during a crash. Moreover, the Cybertruck's sharp, angular design might pose additional risks. In the event of a pedestrian collision, the flat, unyielding surfaces could cause more severe injuries compared to the rounded, deformable fronts of conventional vehicles. Regulatory bodies, including the National Highway Traffic Safety Administration, have stringent guidelines for pedestrian safety, and the Cybertruck's design may struggle to meet these standards without significant modifications. The Cybertruck's design includes a high belt line and narrow windows, which might impede driver visibility. Poor visibility can lead to increased blind spots, making it more challenging to detect pedestrians, cyclists, and other vehicles. Although Tesla is known for its advanced autopilot system, which includes features like automatic emergency braking and lane keeping assist, reliance on these technologies raises another set of concerns. Autonomous systems are not infallible and have been involved in high profile accidents. The combination of reduced manual visibility and potential over reliance on automated systems could heighten the risk of accidents. Manufacturing challenges. The use of 30X cold rolled stainless steel presents significant manufacturing challenges. This material is not only expensive, but also difficult to work with due to its hardness and brittleness. Traditional automotive manufacturing processes, which involve stamping and welding, may not be suitable for the Cybertruck's exoskeleton. Instead, specialized equipment and techniques are required, potentially driving up production costs and complicating the supply chain. Tesla has a history of production delays and ramp-up issues with its other vehicles, notably the Model 3. The complexities associated with manufacturing the Cybertruck could exacerbate these challenges, leading to potential delays in delivery and increased costs. Any significant delays or cost overruns could erode consumer confidence and affect Tesla's financial performance. Scaling up production while maintaining quality is another potential risk. The Cybertruck's unique design and construction methods may not be easily scalable compared to traditional automotive manufacturing. Ensuring consistent quality across a high volume of vehicles will be crucial. Any lapses in quality control could result in product recalls, which are costly and damaging to brand reputation. Market acceptance. The Cybertruck's radical design is a departure from traditional pickup trucks, which could impact its market acceptance. Pickup truck buyers have historically favored models with rugged yet conventional designs. The Cybertruck's futuristic aesthetics might appeal to tech enthusiasts and early adopters, but could alienate traditional truck buyers, who prioritize practicality and reliability over avant-garde design. According to a survey by Cox Automotive, while 29% of truck buyers expressed interest in an electric truck, many also indicated a preference for familiar design cues. The Cybertruck's unconventional appearance might limit its appeal to this broader audience, potentially narrowing its market segment. Tesla has cultivated a strong brand identity centered around innovation and sustainability. However, brand perception varies across different customer segments. Traditional truck buyers might associate Tesla with electric sedans and not consider it a serious contender in the truck market. Overcoming brand loyalty to established truck manufacturers like Ford, Chevrolet and Ram will be a significant challenge. 
Tesla will need to demonstrate that the Cybertruck not only matches, but exceeds the capabilities of conventional trucks to win over skeptical buyers. Regulatory and Environmental Considerations Regulatory compliance is a critical aspect of vehicle manufacturing. The Cybertruck's design will need to meet stringent safety and emission standards in various markets. Given its unconventional design, achieving compliance might require additional testing and modifications, which could delay its entry into certain markets. For instance, the aforementioned pedestrian safety standards could necessitate design changes that alter the vehicle's appearance or functionality. Additionally, while the Cybertruck is an electric vehicle and thus benefits from zero emission status, its production process and material choice could have environmental implications. The extraction and processing of stainless steel are energy intensive and have a higher environmental impact compared to aluminum or other materials commonly used in automotive manufacturing. Addressing these environmental concerns will be essential to maintaining Tesla's image as a leader in sustainable transportation. Tesla aims to sell the Cybertruck globally, but this goal brings another set of regulatory challenges. Different countries have varying standards for vehicle design, safety, and emissions. Adapting the Cybertruck to meet these diverse regulations could complicate its global rollout. For example, the European Union has specific requirements for vehicle safety and pedestrian protection that may differ from those in the United States. Ensuring compliance across all target markets will be essential to avoid legal and financial repercussions. Technological risks. The Cybertruck's performance heavily relies on advancements in battery technology. Tesla promises impressive range and towing capacity, but delivering on these promises requires reliable and efficient batteries. Current battery technology faces limitations in terms of energy density, cost, and charging times. While Tesla has made significant strides with its battery technology, any setbacks or delays in battery production could impact the Cybertruck's performance and market competitiveness. Furthermore, the weight of the Cybertruck's stainless steel exoskeleton could necessitate larger battery packs to achieve the promised range, potentially increasing costs and reducing overall efficiency. Balancing these factors will be crucial to delivering a vehicle that meets customer expectations. Tesla's vehicles are known for their advanced software and autonomous driving capabilities. However, these systems are not without their risks. Software glitches, cybersecurity threats, and the potential for misuse of autonomous features pose significant challenges. High-profile incidents involving Tesla's autopilot have raised questions about the readiness of autonomous driving technology for widespread use. Ensuring the Cybertruck software is robust, secure, and user-friendly will be essential to avoid accidents and maintain consumer trust. Continuous software updates and improvements will be necessary to address emerging issues and enhance functionality. Economic and competitive landscape. The electric vehicle market is becoming increasingly competitive with several established automakers and new entrants developing electric trucks. Ford's F-150 Lightning, Rivian's R1T, and GM's Electric Silverado are direct competitors to the Cybertruck. These companies have extensive experience in truck manufacturing and established customer bases. Tesla will need to demonstrate clear advantages in terms of performance, cost, and features to stand out in this crowded market. The economic environment can significantly impact the automotive market. Factors such as fluctuating raw material prices, trade policies, and economic downturns can affect production costs and consumer purchasing power. The Cybertruck's reliance on stainless steel makes it particularly vulnerable to price fluctuations in the steel market. Additionally, economic uncertainties, such as those brought about by the COVID-19 pandemic, can influence consumer spending and demand for new vehicles. The Cybertruck represents a bold step forward in automotive design and technology, but its unconventional design comes with a range of potential risks. From safety concerns and manufacturing challenges to market acceptance and regulatory hurdles, Tesla faces numerous obstacles in bringing the Cybertruck to market successfully. Addressing these risks will require careful planning, innovative solutions, and a commitment to quality and safety. Despite these challenges, the Cybertruck also has the potential to redefine the truck market and solidify Tesla's position as a leader in electric vehicles. By leveraging its technological expertise and strong brand identity, 
Tesla can navigate the complexities of introducing such a revolutionary vehicle. As the automotive industry continues to evolve, the Cybertruck will undoubtedly play a significant role in shaping the future of transportation. Whether it ultimately succeeds or faces setbacks, its impact on the industry and consumer expectations is already profound. What do you think of our video? Let us know in the comment section below. If you enjoyed this video and want to hear from me again, be sure to hit that subscribe button before you go. Thanks for watching.